Hi, and welcome to Cheeky Richo's Salami Pinwheel Finger Foods. These delicious, easy to make, two ingredient nibbles are going to be perfect for this summer and festive season. You can make them ahead and freeze them and just slice them ready to bake when you need to. Now let's get started. We're going to get one sheet of pre-prepared puff pastry it with our thinly sliced salami slices. You want to keep away from the edge that is furthest from you so that it doesn't get compromised when you're rolling it up. So overlap it a little if you wish but make sure that you don't have it quite to the edge or you won't get a reasonable seal. That's it. Now we roll it up. Just remove the plastic as you go. and get it as tight as you can. And that's all you do. At this point in time, <coughs> you can roll it back up on itself, pop it in the fridge for later, or you can put it in the freezer as it is. So we do the same with our other sheet. So what we have here is 100 grams of salami and two sheets of puff pastry. And then we're going to cut them, let's press it down firmly, keeping mindful to stay away from this edge here. And we're going to cut them into about quarter inch slices. So you get a significant amount of finger food for your outlay. This is quite a tasty and economical and really looks quite nice finger food. That's all you do. Just roll it on itself. And then we bake it in a moderate oven. Just press it down for about 10 minutes until they're crispy and puffed and golden. And you lay them on the ends like so. About five mil thick, straight onto a baking sheet which has been lined with baking paper. Don't press too hard, use a sharp knife. Try to keep them as round as possible. And put as many as you can onto each sheet because that way you're not running the oven for too long, which uh, lessens the economy of this dish. There you have it 27 little bite sized treats out of 50 grams of salami and one sheet of puff pastry. Let's pop them in the oven. Our salami pinwheels are hot from the oven. Take them off the tray and drain them onto some absorbent paper. Don't they look grand? Allow them to cool a little before you eat them because they'll be quite hot. 
I hope you enjoyed this little demonstration of my salami pinwheels. If you'd like to see more interesting finger food and other recipe ideas, just check out my Cheeky Richo channel. Don't forget to leave me a comment and a subscribe. Thanks very much for watching. Have a lovely day.